students, welcome to the Classroom DIY YouTube channel. I'm so excited to bring you guys an unboxing today of this A4 light pad that we got off Amazon. It was $17.99 USD. Before we get started, if you find this video useful, we'd love it if you like this video and subscribe to our channel. I'm very excited to share the first peek with you guys, so let's open this baby up. So right off the bat, we have the cord to plug it in, and it does come with a USB cord, um, no outlet plug-in. So if you do have one of those little USB blocks to plug into the wall, that will come in handy. It looks like it's a micro USB connection, so keep that in mind. If you are planning on using a different cord, you will use need to use a micro USB cord. It also comes with three of these binder clips, so you can clip your painting to the light board. It also comes with a drill straightener, so all you have to do is use this side of the straightener and put it between the rows and columns of your drills on your canvas, and it will straighten out the drill field after you're done diamond painting. Oops, it actually comes with four clips, so that's awesome. We also get a 28-piece container, so let's just show you this. Open it up. There are four sections that are connected and you can basically open up each section individually. So you can use this when you're kitting up your diamond painting or prepping for diamond painting. You'd pour the drills in here and label them accordingly. And there are seven, let's make sure, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven rows of those four, so 28 pieces, 28 sections. So that's really good if you're doing a smaller diamond painting. Then we also have a stand. This is a stand for your light pad. We will assemble it together. So I believe it goes there. And then there. Pretty sure this is how I do it. So you insert it here, insert this end here. And there you have your stand for your light pad. Also adjust these little grip feet. Put that there. Not necessarily the straightest thing in the world, but it'll do to hold our light pad. Now let's get on to the actual light pad. I'm excited. Are you excited? You should be excited. Ooh, so shiny. We'll get rid of this box. This is an A4 light pad from Art Dot. It's three millimeters thick. We have some instructions. So LED light tra tracing board, simple operation, super bright light, adjustable illumination, lightweight and sleek in design, special acrylic surface, eyesight protected technology, and then just accessories and what's included with the light pad, and then instructions on how to use this light pad. So let's set this light pad up. First, we need to peel off the protective film, which is super easy to do. If you don't like that noise, I am sorry. And here we have our light pad. It measures approximately 13.18 inches by 9.25 inches. There's three levels of brightness and it went for, again, $17.99 US on the Amazon.com website. So I'm gonna plug it in. We'll get out this plug. The micro USB connection goes into the light pad itself this USB end, I'm going to connect into a USB plug-in. So now that we have the light board all set up, let's click the on button. So here's one level of lighting, two le second level of lighting, oops, and third level of lighting. So it's very bright. So it goes from a little bit of brightness to very bright, which is awesome. And then if you click it again, that's just the off button. It looks really sturdy. A lot of people have shared that regardless of the light pad brand or 
um, type that you're using that the USB connection here is really sensitive and so you don't want to mess this up so keep this plugged in as much as you can and unplug it from the other area. So let's try out this light pad. I have a diamond painting right here that I'm working on. This diamond painting is from Tin Me Arts. I'm going to put it on the second setting. Here's my cover minder. I have this, this diamond painting covered in parchment paper and we'll take you down a little bit more. So you can definitely see a difference. So symbols are pretty easy to see without the light pad even on, but let's say you're working on a diamond painting where there's dark symbols on a dark background. This is where the light pad would come into play. So let's put it on the first setting. So that's the first setting and you can see them even clearer now. Second setting and the third setting. If you're working in an area with low overhead light or maybe you can't see the symbols properly, a light pad definitely is useful for this. And I find that a lot of diamond painters in the community actually just work with the light pad regardless if the symbols are clear or not. It's just something that we all have in our toolkit and something that we use on a regular basis. To summarize, this is an A4 light pad by ArtDot and it was $17.99 USD on Amazon.com. What are your thoughts on light pads? Do you use a light pad on a regular basis? Is this something that you're thinking of getting? Let, me, let us know in the comments below. And on behalf of Classroom DIY, we thank you so much for watching this video. If this was helpful to you, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button, and we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye.